Are going for the Princess Leah look today. Woo! <laughs> anyway, I hope you all had a fabulous weekend. It is Monday today. My way day in for um, Weight Watchers is on a Sunday. So I thought, you know what? Get back in it. Get back into the old YouTube -y and um, update you with how I got on. So I will just briefly run back into how I got on my first and second week. First week I lost five pounds, second week I lost two pounds, this week, oh, I'll tell you in a minute. Anyway, <laughs> so um, yeah, so I had a really, really, really good week. I've literally logged everything that I've been eating. Like I say, the Weight Watchers app is absolutely brilliant. I love it. Um, it's so easy to navigate. It's just great. If you're Actually, if you've ever used um, the My Fitness Pal app, you will know how brilliant that is. And Weight Watchers is very similar to that. S don't know if maybe you might have to be a little bit careful because it's kind of the general public are plummeting in the information. So be very, very aware of that. Um, and if you aren't sure, you think, actually, I don't think that should be that smart points check it out, run it through the calculator, it's easy enough to do, and then set it up, you know, so you know that it's you, because it will tell you who's actually posted the information for that, so, and if it is me, and, and I do it, I'm all about the smiley, so um, I will put like a little emoji or something on it, just because I'm a bit bonkers like that, so anyhow. So yeah, so I've had a great week on plan. Like I say, I've put everything into the app and just enjoying it. I just, I, I just can't stress it enough. I've already lost, what, seven pounds. So that's half a stone in two weeks. And I actually feel so much better. I cannot tell you. I'm happier. I just feel like all the stress from the previous year with regards to not being able to lose any weight. And I am a little bit miffed, I suppose, because obviously some of you will know I got married in October. And I really, really wanted to lose weight before the wedding, just a little bit more, just so I would be, you know, a little bit less round here and and all of that with obviously having like a strapless dress to wear for the wedding. You know, I just wanted to look really lovely in my wedding dress and though I, I felt good, I just wanted to lose a little bit more. So I just wish that I had changed so long ago because, you know, I was just miserable with it. So I will just put it out there if you are on Slimming World or any other diet plan and you're stressing out about it, it's making you miserable. You don't have to be miserable. You have to do what is right for you. And if you feel that something's not working for you with anything in life, whether it's a relationship, your job or whatever it is, just change it. Change it and make yourself feel better. And I, can, I cannot tell you the difference that swapping over from Slimming World to Weight Watchers has made on me because I was so miserable, as you, you probably know, because all my videos have probably been a bit doom and gloom. But anyway, um, now it's not like that at all. I'm so happy. So like I said, I've been putting everything into the app this week. I've been eating what I call real food without stressing about am I eating enough. You know, I can eat something that, say, might take up quite a, a lot of my points, but I know that I've eaten something decent for that day and not just salad and not just vegetables. You know, because you have those points. I'm allowed 23 points a day, which isn't much. And you can use that quite quickly if you're not careful. But you also have the beauty of having your weekly points as well. So it's kind of a little safety net. So if you fancy a little treat, 
you know, in the evening or you fancy a glass of gin, you know, gin tea or something like that. Two smart points, by the way, for 25 mils of gin. Fantastic. So, and I always weigh everything now. I literally weigh everything. Whereas before, probably on Slim and World, you know, I would use my little spoon measures and, and stuff. But pasta and all of that, I never used to weigh it. I used to just eyeball it. And I think a lot of us do. And especially if you're cooking for a family of four, you know, you just dish it up and think, yeah, that'll do. You know, you don't, you're cooking for everyone. So when you're cooking for everyone, it's really hard to get that portion control under control. So that's why I'm really enjoying it this time. So yes, I might have a different meal from the family or if they're having a roast dinner, I will probably skip having potatoes depending on what meat I'm having because chicken is free, but a lot of other meats that you have, um, well, the majority of meats that you have on Weight Watchers are all pointed. So, you, you know, you're quite welcome to have it. But I kind of like, going for more of the free options and the healthiest, healthier options. So it's literally making me more aware and that's why I love it. And I think that's why it's working, to be honest. So anyway, enough with me chattering on. I got on the scales on Sunday and I lost a pound this week. So that is absolutely fantastic. Last week, like I said in my previous video, um, I've been on my exercise bike a lot and I've been cycling backwards and forwards to school. So this week I thought I will change it up a bit and I'll walk this week and see how we get on because the weather's changed. It's not as nice as it was last week. And I think last week it was like, you know, trying to be full on and make the most of the weather, get the bike out. So you know what I mean. Anyhow, so... What products have I been loving this week with Weight Watchers? Grab a product that I found in Asda that I am loving. So I'm going to share that with you. I'm going to nip to the kitchen. Go and get that. I'll be back. So yeah, so basically it's these little beauties. I don't know if they've been out for very long, but they might well have been. But um, when I did my online shop, I thought I would get some of these. They're only about a pound. And they are um, 30 calories each. And they're two smart points and they're not overly big but they really do sort of kick that sweet craving that you have so um, I highly recommend these to give these a go as well they are really nice so uh, I hope you all have a fab week good luck with whatever diet plan you're following thanks for sticking around if you're going to follow my Weight Watchers journey if you're new to Weight Watchers hello I'm Debbie I've got about a stone I want to lose now need actually probably just a little bit under that now um which seems crazy I mean it's just crazy to me that's eight pounds I've lost in three weeks eight pound and I feel amazing i feel so happy i cannot tell you so i am loving weight watchers like i said to you oh can't get over it anyway guys have a fantastic week i'm gonna do a what i eat in a day video and i'll probably post that on a friday if there's any kind of videos that you would like to see um then just leave leave them in the comments i know a few of you have said you'd like to see a food diary so that will be kind of like I said like a what I eat in a day and then I'll probably maybe in a week or so I'll do a sort of Weight Watchers top tips and some recipes that I'm liking and also I will do a video of all the lovely treats and that that I've got from the Weight Watchers shop. If you do Weight Watchers I'm sure you're already aware of how fantastic the online shop is but also, if you haven't, then definitely go and check it out because it's fantastic and there are some amazing little sneaky treats and stuff on there. And I even had a chocolate bar because they looked so good and I didn't get a headache. So anyway, guys, have a fab week and I will see you next time. And if you aren't following me on Instagram, then please go. I have set my account to private, but... Um, if you just go and request and then I'll, um, you know, I'll let you into the little um, Insta community. <laughs>
anyway guys have a fabulous week bye